Hey guys, welcome back to UTGO Tech Channel. Today I have got something really cool for you. A Bluetooth controlled RC car that you can build using just a handful of components and keep the cost low. Before we start building, let me quickly show you the components we will be using. Our star of the show is an easy to use Arduino Uno. It's small, affordable and perfect for this project. To drive the motors, we are using the trusty L293D motor driver shield. Then we have the HC05 Bluetooth module for wireless communication so that we can control it using just a smartphone. And for the motors, just some simple DC BO motors. For chassis, we are using cardboard to keep the cost low. And lastly, we have a battery pack to connect everything. That's it. Simple, right? Alright, let's start with the motors. First, prepare motors by soldering wire to the motor terminals. Next, use cardboard for the base. For saving money, we will not use hot glue guns. Instead, we will use strong double-sided tape. But make sure they are securely attached to avoid wobbling. Next, we will mount the L293D motor driver shield into the Arduino Uno. This little driver guy is the bridge between the motors and our Arduino Uno. Now connect the motors to the motor driver. Now let's prepare the battery holder to make it a 2 cell series battery holder. And then connect the positive of the 2S battery system to M plus terminal of the motor driver and negative of the battery system to ground terminal of the motor driver shield. Finally, we add the HC05 Bluetooth module. Its job is to receive commands from our smartphone and pass them to Arduino Uno. Next, connect your Arduino to your computer. Now, let's bring this RC car to life with some coding. Open the code given in the video description in the Arduino IDE. Next, you have to install the Adafruit library. For that, open Library Manager and search for Adafruit Motor Shield V1 Library and install this one. After this, code is ready for uploading. Now select the board as Arduino Uno, select the port in which it is connected and click the upload button to upload it. If you want a detailed explanation of the code, then let me know in the comment section and I will upload a code explanation video. After successfully uploading the code, disconnect the USB cable and we are good to go. Now it's time to install the batteries. But before that, double check your wiring. It's always better to catch mistakes now than later. And make sure to insert the batteries in correct orientation or polarity. Now comes the fun part. That's controlling the car. First, pair your HC05 Bluetooth module with your smartphone using phone's Bluetooth setting. After that, open the Bluetooth RC controller app whose link is given in the video description. And select the paired Bluetooth module. And there you have it, a fully functional Bluetooth RC car. Watch as I control it with my phone. This little guy is proof that you don't need a high budget to build something amazing. I hope you enjoyed this project as much as I did. 
if you want to modify the code according to your need and add more functionalities, sensors and hardware then you must know how to use this motor driver shield. For that I have already made a separate video which will help you to master using this motor driver shield. If you want to make this RC car using ESP8266 and control it over Wi-Fi then you must watch my ESP8266 based Wi-Fi RC car video. I would also love to see your builds, share them in the comments or tag me on social media. And stay tuned for the next video where I will be making more fun projects like this. Until then, happy tinkering.